If you thought you knew everything about Love Island UK, you'd be a mug. Here are six things you probably didn't know were happening behind the scenes while the Islanders were doing bits and having right chat. Nudity isn't allowed, even in the bathroom since it's considered a public space. So if cheeky or juicy comments are made while a cast member is in the buff, they'll be asked to say it again when they're fully clothed. One of the main reasons they changed locations in season three was because of the pool. Since it was too large to fully heat, Islanders would barely spend any time in it. And if you think back to most reality TV shows, a pool is essential to help create steamy connections. The production team takes safe sex seriously, as should you. Each Islander is tested for STIs prior to entering the villa. And to further the theme of using safe sex practices, there are more than 200 Love Island branded condoms in the house, and of course they're restocked as necessary. The Islanders have absolutely no idea what time it is at any given moment because clocks and watches are banned and phones all read different dates and times. Season 5's Michael Griffiths told GQ that they tried to make a sundial but still couldn't figure it out. If you've been watching Love Island from the beginning, you might remember how common it was to see contestants smoking. However, after receiving complaints that 52% of the audience found the show glamorized smoking, they banned it altogether, or at least on camera. And finally, a week before the Islanders start filming, each contestant's phone is confiscated and they're all assigned a chaperone. Marlon Anderson from season two told the Huff Post that her chaperone would even follow her into the toilet of a restaurant and would constantly search to see if she had a secret phone. 